Lesson one today, lesson one, write this down. Come from an unlikely source. Anna Grace Webb. How old is Anna Grace, Roger? A four-year-old reminded me last night in such a powerful way of some very important principles of leadership, and it'll be on that basis that we'll proceed this morning. Bear in mind that I didn't say I wasn't serious about it. I'm not making a joke, and I'm not using a child as a metaphor. I'm talking about literal fact. Here's a child who reminded me, and I've been thinking about it a lot because I've got a granddaughter. Two, I got two granddaughters and two grandsons who are all also beautiful and very precocious. But it, it came into focus for me as I watched this child last night. Number one, characteristic number one. <clears throat> She's utterly comfortable in her own skin. Nobody has yet taught her, you're not supposed to look like that. You're not supposed to be from that part of the country. You're not supposed to be in that religion. You're not supposed to go to Georgia Tech. You're not good enough to play for the Green Bay Packers. Nobody said anything like that to her yet. They will. But she's going to be prepared because she is so loved. And she has mentors in her house. We're not all blessed like Anna Grace is to remain comfortable in our own skins. Principle number one of great leaders, they know who they are, and they're very happy with that, and they're satisfied in that context.